One of the significant obstacles on a pro motocross track that you may not be thinking much about is something we call roost. Similar to the wake behind a boat, these race bikes throw a path of destruction. Rocks, dirt, mud, all from the rear tire, which can cause injuries and prevent riders from taking their preferred fast lines around the racetrack. If somebody passes, man, that roost is gonna hurt. You cannot sit in the roost of anybody in front of you. But not only that, there's roost that gets thrown off the front tire as well, so he's roosting his own self, if you can believe that or not. Man, all I gotta say is my chest right now from the roost, it hurts so bad. I have a couple of chipped teeth. <laughs> uh, the roost definitely kind of gets you sometimes, especially because me, like I ride with my mouth open and I, uh, my top two teeth are chipped and I broke this one in half from the roost. When you go to Southwick, the roost doesn't hurt your body as much, but that sand just gets in your goggles, it bounces around and you go through your tear offs too quick. You know, one of the things we haven't talked about here is, is roost. Roost hurts really bad, so maybe that's some of the, the back and forth as you can see. Let's see if Eli can make this outside work. Going up hills, over hills, the texture of dirt, everything like that really affects the roost. Whenever you're behind a guy like a one-on-one -on -one battle, you're kind of swerving around uh, the roost wherever he's at. But at the same time, like say you're at Washougal and you're going up Horsepower Hill and you're buried like 10th or 15th on the start, if you just don't flinch and you just take the pain going up the hill, uh, you're probably gonna be able to get by, you know, a few guys that are kind of flinching, you know? I definitely think of my own roost when someone's chasing me because I think obviously the more you can roost them, the more it can distract them because your vision is so important in the mud. If you can be roosting someone in the mud, you can ruin their game. <laughs>